Hi, I want to talk to you about corns and calluses today. When I tell people I'm a podiatrist, that's usually what they think I do, that I sit in the office and trim corns and calluses all day. Truth is, we do a whole lot more than that, but corns and calluses are, th are something that affects the, the way people's feet function and, and what they can do, and they're, they're a very real problem. So what is the difference between a corn and a callus? A corn is thick, uh, thick skin that occurs on a toe on the top of the foot or in between the toes. Um, a callus is thick, hard skin that occurs on the bottom of the foot. Both are caused from pressure. There's really no difference um, except for the terminology. It's thick, painful skin, basically. You get that thick skin, a corn or a callus, because pressure builds up, either from the toes being rubbing together. If it's in between the toe, you get a little hard area in there. That's a corn. Um, or on the bottom of the foot because you have a pressure point. It could be shoes that don't fit properly. It could be that you have one bone longer than another, that you don't have a lot of meat underneath the ball of the foot. You have what we call fat pad atrophy. Um, there's a lot of different reasons, but basically it's a pressure point. So how do you treat a corn and a callus? You know, you can go to the drugstore. You can buy the corn remover. Um, what is that? It's really just a little bit of acid that peels off the top layer of skin. It's not treating the problem. To really treat the problem, you need to take an x-ray, figure out what's causing it. Is there something going on with the bone? Is there a little bone spur? On the toes, frequently that's what it is. There's a bone spur that's causing the corn, causing the thick skin. You can shave that bone spur off and the corn, or, uh, the corn will go away. Um, sometimes it's caused from a hammer toe, meaning a toe is bent up. Uh, and you rub on the top of the toe, the top of the toe will rub on the shoe, excuse me, and, uh, and that can be very painful. That causes a corn on the top of the toe. In order to fix that, you have to straighten the toe and cut out that abnormal skin to get normal skin to heal back in there. In some cases, you can put the acid on there and, and you can be fine for many months, and that might be a good way to, to treat it. You can certainly try that as an over-the-counter option um, before you go see your doctor and get an x-ray and go through the whole procedure. But truthfully, um, changing the, the shoes, the supports, sometimes using a custom orthotic is about the only way to, uh, to address a coronary callus. And you may just have to live with it if, uh, if an orthotic doesn't work, if trimming using pads doesn't work, um, or surgery is an option. Those are really your options for treating corns and calluses. But it's important to know the difference between a corn and a callus, and that is a corn is just on the toe, on the top, a callus is on the bottom. There's really no difference. It's just thickening of the skin. So I hope that explains the difference and uh, gives you some treatment options. Uh, let us know if we can be of help.